Select the slab tool and change the material of the slab to timber. At the origin, draw a slab matching the size of the curtain wall. Using the spline tool, draw the profile of the parametric wall. To adjust the spline, use the Insert Node option from the pet palette of the spline tool. Then, select the slab. Click on the node and use the Subtract Polygon option to cut out the slab. Select the slab, right-click, and choose Convert Selection to Morph. Open the Morph in Elevation view and rotate the profile as needed. Go to Navigate to File in Libraries and Objects in Save Selection as a Curtain Wall Panel. In the Elevation tab, draw the outline of the parametric wall's elevation. Select the curtain wall and adjust the following settings. Set the nominal thickness of the frame to zero. Set the placement of the frame to inside boundary. Under frame, select all frame types as invisible. Go to the panel tab and select the main panel as CW custom panel. Set the scheme settings as required. Finally, use the magic wand with the boundary geometry method in the elevation tab to complete the process.